Porsche Cayenne review. At a glance the latest Porsche Cayenne is and wildly different from its predecessor, but that what Porsche customers have come to expect. Despite this there's some cutting edge new tech for this third generation model underneath that help Porsche concentrate on improving it in key areas. Starting inside, the new cabin treatment is more attractive and up to date, and occupants should notice significant improvements to refinement too. A lighter chassis and suspension upgrades have helped boost the already impressive dynamics, and as you would expect there are efficiency improvements, too. That said, diesel and hybrid versions are notably absent from the launch lineup which will be a disappointment to some, and Cayenne owners pay a hefty price for the privilege of buying and running this prestigious and premium SUV. The Porsche Cayenne is around today in sufficient numbers to make it an unremarkable sight on the road, but when it launched all the way back in 2002 its unique combination of poor standard performance and handling with SUV practicality made it a real talking point for car enthusiasts. Look up old reviews from the early noughties, and it evident that reviewers found the extreme turbo version especially mind-bending. Some sports car purists hated even the idea that Porsche could build an SUV, but the rest of the world got on with loving it. The result Porsche had an instant bestseller on its hands, making profits the company has been able to reinvest in its sports car lineup. The Cayenne Turbo also provided a wake-up call for many other brands in the luxury FF rotor segment. The headline grabber in the range is obviously the Cayenne Turbo, and the new version offers performance that even more impressive than the last. Its engine is a twin-turbo V8 that delivers 542 bhp and 770 Nm of torque, a small but significant advance over the previous turbo model 4.8 liter V8. Specify the optional Sport Chrono package with launch control, and the latest Cayenne Turbo has the potential to catapult you to 62 mph from standstill in 3.9 seconds thanks in no small part to the amazing traction of the active 4x4 powertrain. Top speed is 177 mph, which is thoroughly impressive, too. Set against its high-performance Stablimate. The standard Cayenne 335 bhp 3.0 turbocharged V6 engine looks weedy, until you remember Sport Chrono equipped versions will crack the 0-62 mph sprint in 5.9 seconds and top 152 mph. The 434 bhp Cayenne S knocks a second off the 0-62 mph time and touches 164 mph.